again after you unmute okay. and you test it. Test. So we're unmuted and transition and live. Hey folks, welcome aboard. It's Murder Hobo Inc. Uh, special shut-in edition. Uh, we know a lot of you are bored with the uh, forced isolation and we're here to help you out. Uh, it'd be easier if you jump in on the game, but eh, you know, not everybody's been made to uh, appear on TV such as uh, ourselves. <laughs> uh, follow us on Twitch, follow us on Twitter, take a look at our YouTube account. Uh, if you want to buy our stuff, like this cool sweatshirt, uh, it's down there near the bottom, tinyurl.com slash RPG swag, along with tinyurl.com slash mhobo inc discord if you want to chat with us. Uh, Carol and Blake were kind enough to go ahead and get that set up, uh, and they really do enjoy it. So if you want to chat with us, or you have some ideas, or you want to ask us some questions, hit us up there. Uh, tonight we've got a special two-person scenario. <laughs> Uh, if you saw us last week, uh, you saw how much fun it was in an urban environment. Uh, let's see if lightning can strike twice and I don't fuck this one up. Uh, I'll give <laughs> you the background here in a minute, but first let's go ahead and introduce our cast. Uh, tonight we have David. David, tell us who you are. Tell us who you're playing. Please. Hi, I'm David and I'm on the Murder Hobo C team. So um, <laughs> I'm fairly new to, uh, to the Murder Hobos. Uh, tonight I will be playing Zadar, the gender fluid changeling rogue. So it should be interesting. If you saw it last week, it was a lot of fun to be held. You were just liking to sexually entice the Guidos. No, that's not a racial slur. No, that's no. That's what we call it. <laughs> uh, and second, our normal issues our producer, Carrie. Who are you and who are you playing? Uh, my name is Carrie. I'm married to this guy over here. and Mr. Seduction. Yes, yeah, him. <laughs> and uh, I'm on the D team, so I rarely play. Uh, <laughs> so tonight I'll be playing my Corona. She's an elven fighter. And. Um, Last time we played, I got to push the dar down the stairs. So maybe I'll get yep. to do that again. Making Funny. sure that the gender fluid changeling was not pregnant. Exactly. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> uh, do you want to pitch your dice? Um, still working on getting my Etsy store up and running, but it's at Pirate Dog Dice. And um, Frank always loves to show them off, even when they're in an unfinished state. Green with envy, aren't you, for that D20? Yeah, they yeah. can't see that very well. You should, yeah, see, the, okay. you should see the clear ones. Uh, the clear <laughs> ones are going to be awesome. Uh, David actually uh, won the big giant 20 uh, playing mm -hmm. bingo. I think we'll do bingo again tomorrow night. Uh, after cool. that, we might put it on hiatus. So if you want a bingo card, if you want a chance to win some cool stuff, uh, hit us up. We'll get you a bingo card, and you can watch tomorrow night and see if you win. Tomorrow night is, of course, campaign night. Uh, we'll see what the five whack jobs are up to at Battle Keep. Sunday, we're also running another special event. This time, Carol's taking the big chair, and she is going to run one of her homebrew adventures. Uh, Blake, Kyle, uh, Scott, Scott, and Heidi have all said they promise to take it easy on her. They're fucking liars folks. they're liars uh tonight especially uh, scott <laughs> especially scott that drunken paladin I, and i still need to post the uh <laughs> that gift god that's funny uh tonight folks uh it was originally going to be first level adventures but we jacked them up to second i call this thing legendary beginnings uh now these guys have made it to city of the rock not dwayne johnson that's probably copyrighted the City of the Rock, uh, they hit a tavern right off the bat. Uh, they're getting some suds down their throat after traveling all day long. And they have been approached by a group of religious individuals, noting that they are adorned in uh, entering attire, and have asked them if they are interested in a job. Apparently a brigand has been causing them a load of problems. So Zadar, my... Uh, are you interested at all in what these guys are selling? Uh, give me a minute while I finish this mead, and then we'll see. <laughs> are you, are you, Might be in a better mood. Are you male or female currently? Uh, I'm in my standard male wood elf form right now. Gotcha. Uh, my Corona, what do you say? Uh, so what religious order are you guys? Uh, these guys are the sons of the old god. 
Okay. Hmm. And what has this person done that you're upset with? Uh, this person is known as Iho. Uh, Iho de Ombre. <laughs> uh, uh, he, uh, he, he's, he came into town a day or two ago, and he's been a giant pain in the ass. The money lenders uh, down the main drag uh, are accusing him of stealing some money. Uh, he doesn't believe in our religion, uh, and uh, he's uh, responsible for vandalizing our temples. So we want to see that this brigand gets his just reward. So we need you to bring him in uh, for a sizable reward, uh, preferably alive. How do you know he we did? Want to make an example. Of. How do you know he fucked up your temple? Because he is a non-believer. So we we have plenty of witnesses. What witnesses? Well, they aren't here right now, but they are ready to swear before the magistrate that he's responsible. If you can bring him, if you can find him, and if you can bring him in. Uh huh. We're told he doesn't like adventurers. So, does everyone in this town follow your religion? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kicking back. It's you the know, just... only religion. Have you never traveled outside of the city of Rock? There is no need to travel outside the city of Rock. <laughs> the one old god tells us all we need to know. Noted. Okay. I see where this is going. Gotcha. Okay. Well, well, my, we helped out that other cleric, so, um, well. That other kinda. cleric was a douche. <laughs> uh, well, well, when do you want this guy by? Is there a timeline? Well, the sooner the better. Pew, pew. <laughs> okay well uh, and you said alive right preferably alive how much dead money? if not but alive how much money are we talking substantial yeah. amount i'd say 200 gold okay that's, that's substantial? substantial your second yeah. level all right gee i'm sorry <laughs> miss money bags <laughs> <laughs> how much money you got right now Hey, that's more money than we made like last time. Sixty-six point five dollars or whatever it is. I was about to say two hundred's more than that. Mm -hmm. We ended up splitting Plus, you would be helping ways. sons of the old god. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Having an old god's favor. So actually, this... you know what? I'm going to do this. Sons of the old god. Okay. So what's this person look like? Zoltan. Sorry. Hey, about yay tall, yay wide. Uh... Ugly hair. He's got a mustachio uh, because okay. you know his name is Iho de Ombre. So what do you consider ombre. ugly hair? It's not cute hair. Not, not like ours. Oh. And what does your hair look like? It looks like a bowl cut. Oh. Awesome. Oh. <laughs> All right. I don't know. This is there... scraggly. Uh, he looks like the killer they executed a few weeks ago named Manson. Oh. Oh. Manson to Charles. Manson to Charles. <laughs> De Carlos. <laughs> yeah. But uh, give me an insight check. Oh, okay. Oh, buddy. Oh, well, yeah, I'm not going to be too insightful. Oh, Lord. Um... Well, that's because you're looking at the bottom of your block. I am. I can't see past the, that stein. <laughs> and neither one of you seem to notice anything unusual. They're. Uh, their request seems believable. I mean, if you don't believe it, you can go look at the temple and see how it's vandalized. Might be penises all over it or something. Let's go check that out. Let's go check out the temple. All right, that sounds good. Let's see what uh, Mr. Del Hombre's <laughs> style is. That's <laughs> Eho to you. E uh, let's go ahead and uh, share screen, folks. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Boom. So you are currently located here at the circle. Uh, there is a temple right here. Let's go ahead and pencil that in. Uh, oh, no, I'm sorry. This is poorly drawn. <laughs> I can tell that this is going to be a disaster. OK, there we go. Okay. Uh, right here is the money. And obviously, this is the temple. Oh, OK. Okay. So maybe we stop by the money lenders first and talk to them. Yeah, we talk the to way. them. Yeah, might as well. It's funny how you do that. Choo choo. Yeah. Yeah. 
Uh, so are you opt? Are you ready to leave the tavern? Uh, sure. I finished my mug. Cool. Uh, you pay for your beverages at the Nicodemus Tavern, and you move on out to uh, the money lenders. You get about halfway there, which is right about here, and you notice uh, there are a lot of pissed off people ahead. They are revolting. Who oh, they are revolting against. Uh, there seems to be a problem with well dressed money lenders and the general populace. It kind of looks like uh, 1929. Oh, geez. Okay. Can we hear what they're saying? <clears throat> yeah. I don't know. Can you? Give me an <laughs> I don't know. Check. <laughs> Give me an investigation check instead. Okay. Not much better. Oh, um, investigation? Uh, uh, 12. I got two. Uh, my Corona, you don't hear shit. Zadar, you're hearing, where's my money? I want my money. Uh, if okay. you guys move closer, you can reroll with advantage. Okay. Uh, let's see. Okay, investigation. Three. Well, twice, uh, take the highest. 19. Nine. Whew, you stink. Uh, you are close enough to hear it, though, Zadar. You clearly hear what the problem is. Uh, the people there uh, are trying to get their money out of the lenders, and the lenders are reporting that they have been robbed. Uh, the nefarious Eho uh, has stolen their money. Gotcha. Um, so this guy is going to be a dick. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so the, the is the mob like, I mean, are they getting to be a violent mob going against the money lender? Or? It, it looks like it. And the money lenders are calling in reinforcements, very large, bald individuals with uh, leather belts strapped across them, uh, very medieval torture looking fuckers. Uh, right. And they're they're waiting because they're waiting like rabid dogs for the money lenders to, you know, hit them again. Are our clerics still with us? No. Oh, fine. You, no, you're, <laughs> you're supposed to find Eho and get him to the magistrate's office. Right, right. But I thought they would have at least escorted us uh, <laughs> to the temple. <laughs> uh, give me an insight check. Okay. Natural twenty. My Corona. Four. You, you need to make some new yeah, yeah i was about to say no, yeah. i'm not using mine uh zadar you're pretty sure that they were trying to recruit some other uh individuals uh so hence you would be on nice. the timeline okay okay so where is the magistrate's office mm -hmm. i've never been to the city of the rock mm. Well, um, would you like to ask somebody or? Yeah. I'd yeah. Like actually, somebody. I'm going to try to make my way to the front of the crowd and get the attention of the money lender. Okay. Uh, Mike Corona, what are you doing? Asking somebody? Uh, I'll back up as a dar. Okay. okay. Uh, you two uh, give me strength checks to push your way through this angry mob. Uh, let's see. Strength. Okay. okay. None of my dice are going to work tonight. Uh, uh, shut up. Throw in a, no, my athletics are the same. 13. Uh, you guys are having difficulty in doing so. Odd my Corona, even Zod. Odd my Corona. Give me a, give me an insight check, my Corona. Mm. Twelve. Somebody's trying to fuel you up. <laughs> like, right, nice. right about the coin purse area. Uh -uh. Uh, let's see, do I have a knife? Uh, what's your strength? <laughs> yeah, you've got a saber uh, uh, rapier, I think. Uh, can I just grab their hand and twist it real hard? See if you can hit. Five. Ah. Oh crap. <laughs> uh, the female avoids your grasp and launches herself into the crowd. 
You can either check your coin purse or give chase. Hmm. I'll give chase. Uh, <laughs> she is quite nimble and the crowd is very thick. Give me two athletics checks. Zadar, since you were leading, you don't know this is going on. So give no. me a strength check to get to the front. Okay. Okay. Uh, strength. 19 for my first. Uh, 15 for Zadar. And Second one? And 22. Oh, sorry. very nice. No. Zadar, you're fine. Uh, Zadar, you push yourself forward. Uh, my Corona, you get about 35 feet and manage to reach out and grab her by the collar and give her a yank, pulling her back. We'll start with Zadar. Zadar, you've made it to the front. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, fuck those guys. Yeah, <laughs> give us our money. Uh, <laughs> for him. Would you like to talk to the money lender or uh, yes. the angry crowd? Uh, I'll talk to the money lender and it's just like, banker, <laughs> and flag, flag him down. It's just like, I'm, um, they're, they're on the steps. Oh, they're on the steps? Yeah. Okay. Like the, the New Rock Stock Exchange. Okay. Steps okay. outside and there's a big flag, City of the Rock. Okay. I'm trying there to There might even be down. a bronze bull over there. Yeah. Yeah, I'm doing this. <laughs> Can we talk? <laughs> uh, give me a persuasion check. Okay. Now we're talking. Okay. No, we're not. <laughs> Turn around and morph um, yourself into a chick. Uh, nine. Uh, nine. <laughs> uh, the money lender takes a step back and does this. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, a no. very large individual starts to careen towards you. Okay. Oh, Hulk mad. Okay. <laughs> And I'm just like, whoa, man. It's just like, uh, I was hired to find the asshole that did this to you. You're talking to Grog the Hulk? Yeah, I'm talking to Grog the Hulk. <laughs> yeah, good luck with that. Uh, yeah, my Corona, but... you've managed to snag the little girl, and she says, oh, excuse me, madam. I thought I dropped something. Yeah. I shake her and ask, what the fuck are you doing? Uh, give me a straight up D20. 18. Uh, you shake her so violently that she loses five gold coins, four silver coins, <laughs> a set of uh, sunglasses, or not sunglasses, eyeglasses. Uh, <laughs> and she, she also drops a copper scroll case. Is she going to answer me? Uh, intimidation check. 17. She will answer. What's your question? Why are you stealing all this? Uh, I need to buy my brother something. What do you need to buy him? A present for his birthday. Where did you get all this from? Any one person? Multiple people? Yeah, multiple people. All right. I take all of it except for a couple gold and let her go. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, she quickly scoops up the coins and takes off running, disappearing into the crowd. You turn around, give me a perception check to see if you see Zadar facing off with King Kong. Yeah. Uh, Sixteen. Yeah, you see him, and you see this hulking figure looming down at him, and you see this big, meaty finger. Let's see if he pokes him. Yeah. Uh, 14 plus 4, 18. Fuck. Well, 18 hits. <laughs> he pokes you in the chest rather bluntly. Okay. And says, you go now. Okay. And it's just like, okay. But I make the symbol for the sons of the old guides and says, I, were hi I was hired by these guys to find the asshole. <laughs> Perse or persuasion check. Okay, let's hopefully it's better this time. Natural 20. Uh, the money lender calls out Grog, hold. Mm -hmm. And he, he, he waves me through. forward. Okay. Uh, by this time, my Corona has uh, weaved her way through. My Corona, D12 against me, please. Hello. <clears throat> 11. 
Natural 12. Uh, as you're weaving your way through the crowd, you hear, somebody's got my eyeglasses. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you reach Zadar, who is walking up the steps uh, past Grog, the enforcer, and there is the money lender. Uh, what? Do you know what this means? Well, hopefully it's nothing derogatory, but I mean, from what I was told, <laughs> it, it was, uh, it represented the temple. No, not that. <laughs> uh, yes, it does. Uh, are you on temple business? We are, actually. And what, what temple business would that be? We are, we are here Perception to- Perception check, both of you. Okay. Um, I'm yeah. pretty perceptive. Jesus. Uh, let's see. So, uh, 20 not natural. Seven. Uh, my Corona, you don't notice it, but Zadar, you hear a body hit the cobblestone, uh, somewhere behind you. As you uh -oh. glance, it, it is a woman screaming, all I wanted were my eyeglasses, as Grog the Enforcer just drops this lady. Oh, crap. Uh, okay. What's uh, your business? <laughs> okay. Focus. I'm focusing. Yeah, says, uh, says the money lender. Sorry, that body hitting the floor just kind of distracted me. She was in the wrong place at the wrong time. No, I agree. Uh, no, uh, we were hired by the temple to find. Yeah, by the temple <laughs> to find uh, the brigand that vandalized the temple and possibly robbed you guys. Emo Mustachio, whatever his name is. E yes, emo. Uh, <laughs> the, the money lighter turns and points to somebody who raises a long trumpet and he blasts it. Uh, the crowd goes silent and the money lender holds up his hands and he goes, people, I give you the heroes that are going to recover your money. Oh, Lord. <laughs> and the people look at you. Uh, give me... Give me straight up D20s. Okay. <laughs> 17. 19. The crowd stays silent and looks at you, and you hear, oh, they look like adventurers. I don't know. They're only two of them. I didn't vote for them. <laughs> uh, the money lender continues, and he goes, people, 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 these individuals are going to bring the rab scallion to justice. I give you their word. So the crowd, uh, as the military starts to move in. So the crowd uh -oh. decides to go ahead and take a hiatus, knowing full well that Grog ain't the only one that's going to be smashing their heads. Right. Uh, the money lender says, good, go. Find this individual. Take him before the magistrate. I want his head on a plate. OK. Could we Before ask a we go, questions? yeah, we got a couple questions to ask you. By all means. How did he rob you? That is the main question. How did he get past Grog back here? Well, is this your first time in uh, City of the Rock? Actually, yes. it is. Oh, well, <clears throat> Money Lender Day uh, is a very busy time. It is a very chaotic time. Uh, as you can tell, we have several tables up and running. The crowd, as you can see, was very vast. There was a lot of distractions. Uh, and he was able to get in and move quickly. We believe he might have roguish attributes uh, and has taken the money. Where did he take the money from? Did he just have it laying out on the table? Was it in a tent? Was it in a case? Yes, it's on the table. That's how money lending works here. So just laying out there. Nobody paying attention to it. You guys really need to work on your security. <laughs> well, Grog's here. Yeah, that worked out for you. Go ahead and do insight checks. Okay. Uh, all right. Uh, Seven. <laughs> Eleven. Uh, something's not adding up. Okay. It, it doesn't sound like he's outright lying to you. Yeah. There's uh, some information that seems to be missing. You can continue to ask questions if you'd like, or you can just go on and take a look at it. Are there any, is there anyone in the guard that seems more intelligent than the others? 
Uh, more intelligent than Grog? Yes. No, these oh. are skull splitters. Oh. These guys are assholes. <laughs> and you can tell most of them were drinking. Okay, well, that makes for good enforcers. Hmm. Makes for good brawlers. How many money uh, lenders did you have working that day? Today, you mean? Or today, yeah. Ten. Ten? Oh. It wasn't a total loss, but we've lost enough that uh, it's going to be problematic. Yeah. Yeah. Not enough capital to cover all those. Yeah, I get it. So Once we cash in the bonds, it'll be okay, but that's not going to be for several hundred years. Yep. <laughs> So how much oh. money did he get away with? Well, we're still trying to estimate it, but it appears to be uh, at least 2,000 gold pieces. Mm. 2,000 okay. gold sesterci. Okay. Well, so you take I mean, that much with you to the market? There's 10 of us. Still. 200 gold pieces each. Mm. Pe people need to borrow money so that they can eat. We are all about the people. Right. Uh, roll insight. Uh, uh, again, 12. Uh, yeah. Bullshit. This fucker's lying there. <laughs> he does not give a crap about people. So yeah. how much interest do you charge on this? Uh, we charge 50%. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay. It wow. is fair. Okay. 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 Uh, let's see. Do not question our practices, outsiders. <laughs> well, uh, the temple seems to be picking up the, the tab on this investigation, but I think maybe for a little added coin, we could probably expedite things a little faster. Good point. Persuade me. Okay. <laughs> okay, hopefully this will work. Uh, persuasion. 19. That's a you. fair and reasonable request. Okay. If you bring back our money. Okay. We want half. We'll give you, we will give you a finder's fee of 20%. Mm. Which is fair. Oh, yeah, look at my, do you really think we're going to get any more out of these guys? Do Probably we really have not. to tell them that we found the money in the first place? Hmm? You're not You're saying this things. out loud, are you? No, I'm whispering <laughs> to you. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to tell him fair enough. And we'll figure this out as we go. <laughs> Very good. 20%. Mm -hmm. 20%. Yeah. Yes. So that brings our total... Money to lender Hans Gruber says agreed. Nakatomi Bank of the Rock. <laughs> Nakatomi Bank of the Rock. Sean Connery, president. Oh. Well, welcome to the Rock. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, the, the money lenders are starting to pack up. The crowd has moved off. The military is just kind of weaving in and around, making sure that they don't have to beat anybody. Yeah. Everything is mellowed substantially because you heroes are here. Uh, so I asked my, uh, my, where did you take off to? Oh, uh, there's this little girl pickpocketing me. I had to go take care of it. Oh, uh, okay. Um, hmm. She was working the crowd, so. Huh? Yep. Okay. I wonder who she answers to. The uh, were they young? Yeah, she was real young. Yeah, chances are they're working for somebody. So. Hmm. You didn't happen to see where she ran off to? Huh? I didn't. She said she was needed money for her brother's birthday, so I just took <laughs> some money and. Center on you saw way. her run down the main drag. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, we're headed that way anyway. So, um, yeah. We'll, he's on we'll, the way to the temple. Yeah, we'll head on down the road. He's on down. He's on down the road. Mm hmm. Yeah, Scarecrow's with us, busting a move. Uh, you guys <laughs> make it to. Uh, we'll use this. Right here. Okay. Uh, this is a row of market stalls. Okay. I will take a perception from each one of you. Twelve. Uh, Fourteen. Uh, Zadar, you have a better score, but you would not know what this child looks like. 
Uh, my Corona, what was yours? 12. 12? Uh, seven. Uh, you believe you spot your quarry uh, dodging in and out of the marketplace. They are currently over at the cheesemongers. Oh, awesome. Stranger. Behold okay. the power of cheese. There she is over there at the cheesemonger. Oh, okay. So do you uh, want to go see if we can corner her? Um... Or maybe buy her some cheese. Take the yeah. good cop, bad cop approach. Sure. Okay. I'll let you be the good cop. Um. Okay. Okay. So is she trying to purchase cheese? She's no. stealing it. She's okay. trying to steal shit. Okay. Uh, I'll walk up to the cheese monger. Uh, do I notice her trying to pilfer the cheese? Uh, you notice that she is... Uh taking a uh, wedge of American cheese <laughs> off the table, and uh, she has secreted it in her pocket. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> As she points over to the more expensive cheese and asks the cheesemonger about it, when he turns to okay. where she's pointing, she nicks it. Okay. Uh, I'm going to try it in my sleight of hand to nick it from her. <laughs> Fair enough. Go ahead. All right. Oh, uh, let's see. Sleight of hand. Hopefully, I roll better. Or, <laughs> um, uh, actually, uh, uh, twenty, not natural. Uh, she gets an eighteen. Uh, you manage to nick the cheese, uh, but she feels you in her pocket and screams, "Molester! Molester! Molester!" <laughs> I'm like, get yeah. <laughs> cheese monger, pike, pike down, and, and I sees hold... you holding the cheese. He goes, "Are you gonna pay for that?" Yeah, I am, but she wasn't, so she's using this opportunity He's to rip you off. Touching me inappropriate. <laughs> You're gonna believe the girl that just pocketed your cheese? I don't. You're think the one so. holding the cheese, dude. Uh, two guards take notice and wander over. Yeah. Uh, is there a problem here? Yeah, don't let her go anywhere. <laughs> she oh, I'm so sorry. Sure, Captain. Uh, <laughs> anything else you want me to do? You want me to get you some uh, kosher cheese? Well, I if you're buying. I and ask them to search her. <laughs> oh, whoa. Sure. So they throw both her and Zadar up against the cheesemongers thing and begin to rifle through your pockets. Yeah. My pockets of her. Her, yeah, her pocket and Zadar. Okay. Okay. See, the little kid is probably gone by now. I would oh, imagine. No, she's there. Oh, okay. No, they, the the cops are searching you and the little girl. It's not like I have any contraband. So. Uh, Zadar does not have any contraband aside from his weapons and things of that nature. My Corona D12 against me. I will be the girl. If you go higher than me, she will have stuff. On. Twelve. Seven. She does indeed have some items on her that do not seem to belong to her. And they ask her who, who she is, and she says, I am Tiffany. Tiffany, yeah. just Tiffany? <laughs> or do you have a last name? Does she sing in malls? Oh. Just, <laughs> Tiffany. just Tiffany. I'm so just Tiffany. I only need one name. Uh, and she goes, this man touched me rudely. And I tell, eh, I look at the guard, seriously, guy, that is not my bag. I caught her stealing this cheese, so I'm going to try to roll let's off. Let's roll off on persuasion here. Okay. Ooh. Didn't do so hot. Okay. Uh, persuasion, 16 total. 10 for her. Uh, <laughs> the guards take one look at you and go, uh, he doesn't look like much of a molester. No. <laughs> uh, I don't think so. Haven't we had problems with you before, young lady? Uh, and they start to drag her away. And she says, now wait, 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 wait. That lady, she's my boss. And she told me to go steal stuff. You should search her. What am I going to have? My glasses. No, I only <laughs> took the two gold pieces. I thought you took everything but the gold pieces. No, I took two gold pieces and let her have everything else. Oh, oh, oh So oh, she had oh, all that other oh, stuff. Oh, so she had all that other... oh, okay. I, I was under the impression that you... No. Uh, 
Uh, so they find all the other shit on there, and they look at you, and they go, hands up, we're going to search it. They search you. Uh, they <laughs> dally a little bit about certain areas, uh, but they're like, she's a pretty shitty boss if you were supposed to give her some stuff. Um, uh, and they each grab an arm, and they start dragging her away. But as they do, she turns her head and goes, Okay, and uh, I I say, gentlemen, uh, hold on. hold up, She's hold just on. a little kid. Yeah, uh, a little the, thief is what she is. Well, the, you know. uh, I turned to the cheesemonger. I says, "Look, we we caught her red-handed, and we returned your merchandise. I mean, and I'll buy some brie off of you. Yeah, yeah. If if you let her go, I mean, she's just a kid. We'll take so. her home and make sure she gets home and off the street." Both of you persuade me. Uh, one okay. for the cheesemonger, one for the guards. Who okay. wants to? Uh, I'll take. Uh, I'll I'll take the guard. Okay. So, uh, the guard is uh, eighteen. Okay. Uh, twenty. Uh, the guards are like, fine. I didn't want to do paperwork anyway. And cheesemonger says, okay, if you want some brie, Olson can go ahead and uh, get it made up for you. Be, it'd be one gold though. That's fine. Yeah, yeah. that's their problem. Uh, they dropped the kid because they had her suspended and her, her feet were <laughs> well, feet were running around. Uh, and she kind of does the sideway glance to check out her surroundings. You know, yeah, okay. We each I, put a hand on her. <laughs> yeah. I I produce a gold piece. I say, look, if you can take us to your boss, this little this uh, nice new shiny gold piece might be yours. I don't know, boss. I'm an independent contractor. Yeah? Is that Insight so? Insight check. Okay. Uh, let's see. Insight uh, 16. Yeah. Seems legit. <laughs> Seems legit. It's just like, okay, well, before Do you, you go off. you have a mom? Not anymore. Thank you for ripping that scalp. <laughs> Where do you live at? Uh, the gutters on the north side of town. Is your brother there? Uh, no, he's probably out uh, finding nope. stuff. Finding <laughs> stuff. I said, is today really his birthday? Sure. In like, sight. Sure. <laughs> sure. <laughs> okay. Uh, insight, not too bad. 17. 17 for her. Oh, okay. So we're about even. <laughs> maybe, maybe not. Maybe. All right. So I asked her, do you know about this emo mustachioed guy? Uh, you mean Eho de Ombre? Yeah, uh -huh. that one. <laughs> yeah, everybody's mad at him. Well, what do you know about him? I know that the money lenders think he stole all their money. Did he? No. Who did? <laughs> These guys. Ah. Oh, really? Tell tell us a little more about those guys. I don't know. I'm having trouble remembering. <laughs> Would you like my brie? Uh, no, that stuff's gross. <laughs> I wanted the American. You should have bought the American. <laughs> uh, are you giving her the coins that are, or just waving it at her? I'm just waving it at her at this point. Tell me a little more about the temple. So, and the people that work there. Mm, it's down that way, and those people are jerks. Okay. Uh, how? You're gonna work for this, so might as well cough up. Well, I don't. I don't. I don't swing that don't way. That there, way. <laughs> I followed through this elf. before. I'm not going into the alley, pal. No, 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 no. This is on the up and up. We really want to find this guy, but if these guys are assholes, like you say they are, then I mean well, they don't would... like the homeless, and they they treat us poorly. They're supposed to give us food, but they don't. They don't. There's there's never a bread line or anything like that. Nope. Insight. Okay. Um. Insight. Uh, 15. Yeah, not sure. Not sure. So what okay. do they need all this money for? Uh, they're a church. 
they don't pay taxes here in uh, City of the Rock and all they want is more money, more money, more money. And they don't realize that it causes no problems, no problems, no problems. Well, okay. Where are they spending their money at? Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to need, yeah. You know. <laughs> really? Yeah, really. Because the guards are gone now. Yeah. Okay, I'll add a gold piece to his if we get more information. Okay. What's the question? All right. Where are they spending this money at? It's all in the temple. Mm, so okay. they're just collecting it? They're not doing anything with it? Right, they're hoarding it. That's what rich people do. Have you not met rich people? But usually they, you know, big houses, uh, lots of horses and wagons, something. Let me ask you this. How much gold were you able to get off of them? Oh, uh, we do not rob from the church. You do not rob from the church, but yet you Even rob though they're from assholes? you. You drive from us, okay? Well, yeah, they'll kill me. I don't know what you guys will do to me. Okay, so they have well, enforcers. Well, he fondle you, obviously. Uh, clearly, yeah. <laughs> Zadar the molester, <laughs> Jesus. So uh, I say, Zadar the touchy. <laughs> Hey, I, I didn't touch her. <laughs> Your hand was in the pocket, dude. Uh, oh, okay. Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> so I asked her, I said, do they have enforcers that, like, go out and, you know, deal with you guys or, or what? Were you struck in the head by something? Of course they have enforcers. Look, this okay, is the first time I, in I, this I, town. Yeah, I was about to say, hey. I, have you I, never I, met corrupt government officials? Or adventurers. We don't so live that, anywhere. So this is a theocracy? Is that what you're trying to tell me? No. Do you know what that word means? <laughs> yeah, I live in the streets. I'm not stupid. Okay. So if it's, a the if it's not a theocracy, then who holds them accountable? Clearly nobody holds them accountable. Why okay. not? Because the magistrate doesn't care. Okay. Why not? I don't know. Maybe he's getting paid off. Hmm. Hmm. It's his job to keep the peace. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we haven't run into the magistrate yet, so. Mm, his office is down there. Mm. Let me ask you this. Have you been arrested? Oh, how about, how about grease in the palm here? I've been I, giving you a lot of information. I haven't gotten two golds worth of information out of you yet. I've got a lot of accusations, so. <laughs> yeah, very little proof. So, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, Mrs. Matlock. <laughs> <laughs> so. So, come on, out with the well, out with the information. So there, there's something here you're not telling me. I mean, basically, you've told us that they're the ones that are taking the money from the people, which is really, I mean, that's what churches do. Uh, secondly, you're saying that they're in control of everything around here, yet. Uh, I don't know. I, I'm not seeing anything. I'm seeing anything to to really corroborate with this, other than the fact that they they asked us for help. Look, so. I, I don't know what their problem is with Eho or his Segadora. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. So you know his, Eho. his posse. Oh, okay. I've yeah. seen him. I don't know him. Never met him personally. Have you okay? seen his posse? Yeah. Where do they hang out? Taverns taverns yeah one of them one of them actually hangs out at uh uh where does he hang out at angelo's Angelos. can you point us that way and can you tell me what this guy looks like uh sort of a you know, rat face guy um kind of ugly uh kind of just a chump Okay, huh. that's really helpful. So Angelo's. Does he look like a Guido? I don't know what a Guido is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so Angelo's is right there. Okay. On the corner. All right. I tell her, look, you get the two gold if you take us to Angelo's and point Mr. Ratface out to us. That works. Why do I got to do that? You don't have anybody else. Yeah, I was about to say. I'm going to need half the money up front. Uh, we could turn you into the guards. 
Yeah. Well, and then you're going to we'll... figure out who it is. Oh, looks like we're teammates again. Uh-huh. Half. Fine. I got to buy my brother a present. But you're going to hold my hand all the way there. I don't swing that way. Neither do I. <laughs> I can put I'm you on a leash. We'll, we'll get, we'll, 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 yeah. So slavery is illegal here. That's not going to work either. Oh no! This is how we keep women and children you. in control. <laughs> not in this town. Fine, I'll lead you there. Yeah, lead us there. You'll get your money. Don't worry about it. Uh, we put up with you for this long, then yeah, we we really want to get this done. Okay. Uh, as you go by, you notice that this location. I stand corrected. You don't see shit. So okay. she, she is going to lead you from here and up this other main drag. Uh, this is more of a, uh, uh, give me an insight check. Okay. Ooh, not with that score. Uh, 12. 10. Both of those are good enough. Uh, this place is a little questionable. A little questionable. Passed by a, an inn called uh, the Modiere. <laughs> uh, you see some sexual proclivities going on in the alley. Uh, okay. and you see giant rats, like R-O-U-S's, uh, mm -hmm. roaming in between the buildings. This is really kind of a seedy place in town. But uh, she takes you to this corner building, and it says... Angelos, because some of the paint is missing. Oh, uh, okay. Awesome. <laughs> nice. Uh, and there's a pair of wooden dice hanging off the sign. Ooh, dice. Okay. Um. <clears throat> yeah, I tell her. Um, can you see that guy from here? Uh, or the doors Outside? open? Outside? No, I cannot. I cannot see. Uh, Hold on. Mr. D. I can't and see through the wall. I've never struck a child before, but yeah. I will. We're, we're close to it. <laughs> uh, no, is the door open to the place? It seems to be a public resort. <sighs> that isn't what I asked. <laughs> okay. There's a door. I mean, it's the, the, what the door is in. If it, you know. So okay, can we can go gotcha. in and sit down and grab a table with the kid. Sure. Uh, as you walk in, you notice that the building is definitively two different businesses. Okay. One uh, appears to be an eatery of some kind. Right. Uh, and the other uh, is filled with gambling tables. Okay. I look, I, I look at the kid. Have you eaten yet? I can stand to have a bite since somebody stole my American cheese. Sure. Let's get you something. So. So we'll go grab a table or whatever. Okay. When you sit down, she tucks her napkin into her shirt. Is it plaid? Please tell me it's plaid. It's plaid, but it's blue and white, not stereotypical. Oh. Oh, no, we aren't going to do that. Okay. Because Angelo's is a Pakistani food place. It is not an Italian place. Oh, uh, okay. Right. Is there hummus Mixing here? it up. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say. There's hummus and camel bobs and uh, oh, Lord. things. Of, uh, there's, uh, oh, what do they call it? Uh, flat desert oysters, flat. if you know what I mean. Oh, damn. No. <laughs> Rocky mountain oysters. Oh, Seriously, except okay. they're... Camel testicles. Oh, okay. No, no. <laughs> and you see an individual from, that looks like Babu from Seinfeld who comes up. Welcome to Angelo's, my friends. What can I get you? Angela, what, uh, do you have falafel? D12. Okay. Yeah, I hope so. 12. Oh, oh, no. Hopefully that is, okay, nine. Um, Am I close enough to get a falafel? It'll take a while, but we can make you falafel. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, whatever this kid wants. Yeah. What uh, you want, kid? She wants the oysters. Okay. She'll and have, she'll have the oysters. We have some fried cheese of some kind. D twelve. Yeah, four. Seven. Uh, we do, but I would not recommend it. How about just some bread? Sure, we got bread. All right, I'll take some bread. 
<clears throat> Give me a perception check. Okay, uh, 18. 19. You both notice that the busboys are cleaning up a very long table at the far end of the building. Like, getting it ready? Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, it, it had old plates and stuff like that on there. Yeah. So mm-hmm. they're cleaning up from a gathering? Yes. Tiffany is looking around. Yo, Tiff, you see anything? D12 against me. <laughs> 12. Nine. <laughs> yeah, nobody looks familiar here. Okay, nobody that looks That guy's cheating. Oh, Points yeah? to an individual at one of the dice rolling games. Mm-hmm. Uh, the longer you watch him, the more you notice... Mm-hmm. He's shaking the dice, yeah, and throwing them out there. But then, as he drops his hand, you notice he's got other dice in his hand. Right. Okay. So he's clearly cheating. Yeah. Uh, the food comes. She takes one bite of the oysters, and <laughs> this is gross. Of course it is. Has our falafel hit the table? Oh no, it's there. Okay, I slide the falafel to her. You'll like this better. No, I'm not hungry. Do you oh. know these are camel testicles? What the hell? Yeah. <laughs> would have told me. Oh, by the way, the camel testicles are the most expensive thing on the menu. Oh, of course they are. Of course they are. <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> uh, my Corona, your meals also come. Uh, I will take constitution checks, not saves, for both of you to see if you like the meal. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, not too bad. Uh, 19. Yeah. Yeah. Both meals are good. Okay. Yeah. Like it. Uh, you notice that Tiff has started to drink. She, she like started young. to drink? Yeah. They like... bought three wines. Oh, okay. <laughs> Is she drunk yet? Like, how's that wine, Tiff? <laughs> it's okay. I prefer the rosé. And she goes, hey, there's that guy you were looking for. Okay. Which one is that? The rat face guy? The rat face guy right over there. So okay. the emo guy or his posse? Uh, one of the posse members. All right. Okay. So, all right. Um, so I guess we give her the 20 gold or no? 20? No, I'm sorry, two. You go over and make contact with him. Make sure who he is. Okay. And uh if he is, then I'll give her the money. Hmm. Let me think about that for a second. Um, I take a good look at Tiffany and say, I'll be right back. So is there is there a privy? Sure. Okay. I make my this way to the big city. We got we got shit like that. Yeah, okay. This you is guys dump. All right. So I'll pull my hood up and uh, you know, so you know, nobody can see me distinctly. Go into the rest, uh, the privy, and all that, and shape shift to look like a kid similar to Tiffany. Okay. So. Sure, you do a pretty good job. Okay. And um, yeah, so um, I walk back out, and it's just like um, uh, to the table, and uh, God, what am I gonna do? <laughs> Uh, I don't know. I try to solicit them for, you know, do a little begging. For food. Please, sir, I haven't eaten. More gruel? <laughs> <laughs> go away. Go away, child. Go away. Oh. Oh, please, About sir. that time, you feel a very firm hand on your shoulder. My Corona, you notice some of the enforcers have taken notice of this rat uh and seem to recognize her uh i said Tiffany, similar not tiff and not not uh, exactly it, like her it's, it's dimly lit uh my corona tiffany starts to laugh reaches over takes the dar's glass of wine and starts to drink it as she soaks in what's about to happen right and she turns to you and says oh yeah they don't like beggars here and just drains that fucking class uh zadar initiative 
Okay. Uh, I'm not. Uh, all right. Uh, <laughs> five. Ugh. Uh, two of them grab you by the shoulders and lift you up, but okay. seem puzzled. Because I I don't I weigh more than I look. <laughs> yes, you're much more dense. Okay. Uh, they toss you. Okay. Dwarf tossings in fashion. Yeah. Uh, but roll poorly and don't release in time and slide you across the wooden floor, uh, causing a significant amount of road rash right here. Not here or here, but right here. Right here, yeah. And they and I, do... I start doing the little girl cry. <laughs> or damage as you get a splinter through the cheek. Oh. Uh, this causes Tiffany to bust out laughing. Yeah. Uh, but she and my corona are on the far side, so the enforcers do not hear it, and they start to bicker among them. You throw on three. Well, I thought you meant one, two, three. No, I meant one, two, three, throw. Uh, so as they're bickering, they're like, let's try this again. And they start to move towards you, Zadar. Okay. And, uh, yeah, holding my face and crying, I just run out of the place. Uh, my Corona, what do you want to do? Hmm. I'll sit there with Tiffany and drink. Okay. Okay. So, um... Uh, is there an alley or anything like that? Sure, there's the alley where the sexual proclivity is going on. Oh, jeez. Okay. Nice. <laughs> if well, you've they're seen not paying spy. attention, so I don't think it's a big deal. <laughs> yeah. right. If you've seen Spy, you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, I'm just trying to think if the... Is there any place where I could do an inconspicuous change? Oh, yeah, in the alley. Yeah, figure. Okay. Give me a straight up D twenty. All right. Uh, straight up D twenty is only a four. Oh. You step in poo. <laughs> oh jeez. Okay. Why can I have stayed a bard? Press the digitate. <laughs> Be fine. Okay. Uh, but the yeah. good news is the couple is now completed their transaction and are leaving the alley. Okay. As they leave or whatever, I try to clean off my shoe and <laughs> shuffle my way back in there uh, to the alley and uh, kind of tend to my wound a little bit. Um, uh, did I see the 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 woman that walked <laughs> out with with them? Like clearly, uh, so you said the gravity. Yeah. Uh, no, you can only see the back of her head. <laughs> Okay. Uh, uh, okay. Let's give this another try. Uh, I sh I shift myself into um, a female human, roughly on the hotness scale, probably about a six. Sure. You know, for I figure for this part of town, that might be pretty good. Sure. So, okay. Um, and uh, enough makeup to kind of cover up the scar a little bit. So, so Tammy Faye Baker re-enters the gambling hall? Mm-hmm. Okay, fair enough. Yeah. Uh, Mike Corona, you and Tiffany uh, have ordered another round, uh, and Tiffany says, leave the decanter. She's buying. Really? <laughs> My mother will buy it for me. Oh my Thanks, God. Mom. What an ass. <laughs> uh, Angelo leaves it uh, and mm -hmm. uh, asks if the uh, oysters were not to her liking. And what does the little girl say? She says, no, she has a cold and she couldn't taste them. Mm. <laughs> Lucky Should've her. ordered the bread. <laughs> <laughs> How'd she as enjoy you, that falafel? <laughs> as you say that, you notice she's eating bread. Yeah. Kids. You oh, can't yeah. kill them and you can't kill them. Uh, give me a perception check to see if you notice Tammy Faye Baker walk into Angelo's. Uh, 11. Yeah, you notice some skank walk in, but you pay her no attention. 
Okay. Let's see if the so... kid notices. Nope, not a clue. Okay. So is the rat face guy still there? Yeah, he's talking to somebody at uh, one of the tables. <laughs> I kind of do a sachet past the tables and all that and kind of head up to the bar. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if he likes that. Okay. <laughs> Apparently he doesn't? He okay. does not. Okay. All right, so I pay so the tab. So that's not working. Give Tiffany her money, and I go over and try to talk to him. Fair enough. Okay, I'll just watch them in the, from the corner. Okay. Uh, let's see if he likes my coin. Apparently he doesn't swing that way. You got a two and Zadar got a five. So, wow. uh, he looks at you and goes, may I help you? Uh, I, I just got a question, couple questions to ask you. If Do that's I know okay. you? No. Okay. It's about your friend, emo mustache guy. What do you want with Eho? Um, I don't necessarily want anything from him per se or with him. I would just like to know why everyone seems to be against him. Because he is the charismatic leader of our uh, group. What group is that? Uh, I don't think I gave him a group's name. We'll call him... Uh, Uh, I can't think of any dumbass group names. Oh, we'll call them the Jets. <laughs> so, do, I mean, do you and guys... suddenly Zadar's name is Maria. That's right. <laughs> so, do you guys do anything as a group? You just are a group. Do you have any public works that you do? We go to the poor. Oh. So I've and... been hearing a lot of stuff from the sons of God or whatever oh, yeah fake cultist right so what's the deal here they just don't uh, care for us insight check ah 20 he's lying he's hiding something mm. so why don't they care for you i'm sorry who are you again I'm an interested party because the sons of whatever have been accusing him of stealing money from the money lenders. We don't steal money. We make it here legally. Legally or illegally? Legally. I'm an excellent gambler. Oh. oh okay. And he whips out a card. Is this your card? And strangely enough, you were thinking about the nine of spades. Awesome. <laughs> so how long have you been in this town? We've been here about a week, not quite a week, maybe. So it's only taken a week and they're already on your ass? We make a big entrance. We're very seductive to the population. He is, I'm not. And you can uh -huh. tell that this rat face guy does not have a good charisma. Okay. And he turned his nose up at a six. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you know. hey, if he doesn't swing that way. You know, yeah, that's matter. true. Yeah. Maybe that's you could true. go morph into a male. Good. Or, or maybe this or is. Uh, guy. <laughs> maybe this is Stooley the denutted. You don't know? Yeah. That's true. Yeah. Uh, I. Uh, I Can you remind him of his sister? I order a drink and I go walking by and all that. And do I hear her say like "miho" or something like that? Like, Cor Corona say that in the middle of the conversation? Oh, you would have been close enough to hear her. Oh, okay. Uh, I walk by and it's just like, oh, did I hear correctly? You talk about that, oh, that roguishly good-looking Miho. As you say it with four teeth and body odor for your charisma. He's a six. He can't be that bad. Yeah. Come on. 
<laughs> wow, these guys have got pretty high standards. Right? Hey, Angelos is a classy joint. Yeah. Uh, yeah, one of the barmaids is a 12. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, come on. The other's a 19. Who's a classy joint. Uh, yeah. Who are you? Why are you people here? Why are you people talking to me? Oh, I just came in for a drink. And it's just like, but I heard you talk about Miho, and it's just like, oh, I, I, I saw you guys on the street. You just, oh, oh, it's a, it's so nice to see Good men of a, <laughs> men of a higher caliber around here. <laughs> Sorry, uh, performance <laughs> is a sixteen, so it's not awful. <sighs> you groupies bug the hell out of me. Yes, he's very dashing. Yes, he's very charismatic. That is why he is our leader. Oh, oh. you should have heard what these these horrible men at the bank were saying about you guys. They say you robbed them. I they just robbed the that, people. I, I told them that was nonsense. That was nonsense. So, Is that why you look the way you do? Because you told them they were full of shit? Yeah. They beat you to death? Yeah. I hit, you, uh, I hit magic ugly stick. I was about to say I hit. I fell out of the tree and hit every branch on the way down. Indeed, you did. I started out as a twelve working at this place, and then. <laughs> oh man! So what do you guys want? Uh, uh, it's, it's just the uh, um, uh, uh, for me. I was I was hoping Miho would. Uh, 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 help me. I mean, I've run into some problems, and I was wondering if, uh, you know, the the church won't help the poor. I was trying to find somebody who does, and you guys seem like upstanding people. Compared Here? To, yes, compared to the... Do you think I trust the, the upper echelon of this? Russian? Thing? <laughs> no, no, I no, I am not doing that. Uh, uh, you think I trust the church, the magistrate? No. They're just jealous of us. I mean, oh, I mean, fifty percent interest on a loan. It's just like I tried to, I tried to open a legitimate business myself, and uh, what kind of business? <laughs> well, what kind do you think? Grave digger business? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, no, actually, just working in, that... in the field, scaring birds away mm -hmm. business. Mm -hmm. No, actually, <laughs> I, actually, a little bed and breakfast. We we're gonna put it up on Airbnb. Oh, I don't think anybody wants to bed you, sweetheart. <laughs> oh, it's in, you know, no, seriously, it was the uh, with the big cans. Yeah, I should have. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, it is clear that you are not going to get anywhere with this dude. Yeah, obviously. So, Mike Corona, just... what do you want to try? Do I realize that this is Zadar at all? Uh, give me a perception check. Actually, give me a straight up 20, Zadar, straight up 20. Okay. Oh, crap. Three. <laughs> Eight. Yeah. You aren't sure where Zadar went. Okay, she uh, can't. She, she can't see like uh, the the naked lady peering out from anywhere or anything like that. No, the naked lady's gone. Oh, okay. Um. Oh, oh, okay. I got it. I, I was about to say I didn't get rid of it. <laughs> I go out in the street. And... Okay. Okay. And uh, yeah, I, I, you know, stammering walk with my cheap Kia or whatever it is out of the door. And I'm like, bye, oh, no, boys. That, that glass is, oh, when you got it at the bar. Okay, yeah, yeah. that's fine. I'm like, bye, boys, and stagger, uh, stagger my way out. Uh, and I'm just like, I uh, don't know what, wine in this place. I, I look to my Corona and I was just like, you know, and we walk to the alley or I walk to the alley. Like, lady, what do you want? I'm just like. I understand she's a molester. <laughs> I'm not following that lady. She's only got three teeth. But she knows how to use them. 
Ew. And I and I say in Zadar Zadar voice, it's like it's me. Follow me. Oh, fine. So you guys are now in the alleyway. Zadar, are you gonna change back? Yeah, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna change back into um, a male elf, but with a different face. Okay, fair enough. <clears throat> you are in this alley right here. And you can both roll for initiative. Oh, crap. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, let's see. Uh, for me, that's uh, 15. Well, uh, eight. Uh, Zadar, my Corona, you notice a couple of ruffians headed your way. Okay. They... Uh, they appear to be religious individuals. Religious individuals. Okay. But not these guys. They're these guys. Oh, crap. Different religion entirely. Is Oh, okay. Is, is it blue? Uh, yeah, they're sharks. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> okay. Hey, what are you guys doing? Zadar, uh, you got initiative first. How okay. would you like to respond to these fucks? Uh, uh, I, I say I, I tell him um, we came we came seeking an audience with Miho. Oh. Okay. Well, and they look at both of you. Uh, you're gonna do it a little bit uh, with less gold. Give us your money. Oh, well, I mean, if you think you can take it. Mike Arona, you had last initiative. Okay, fair enough. Uh, we'll start at the top of the order. Zadar, these guys are going to take your money. If they can try. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, go after them. Okay. All right. So, uh, using rapier and dagger and, and the other. Uh, I'm gonna take. Uh, I'm gonna attack with the rapier first. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's see two. Sorry, gotta get to my attack page. <laughs> AC ten, real easy to hit. Yeah, uh, ten. Sure, you hit. Okay. Him. All right, with the rapier, that's one uh, d eight plus four. Okay, four, four. Uh, I hit him with eight points for that, and then I'm going to hit him with the dagger in the okay. offhand. Uh, with that, uh, no, I missed with the dagger. Fair enough. Uh, I'd light you up even. 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 Uh, when I say even, was going to hit you, right? Uh. I think so. I think uh, so. My Corona green, Zadar orange. Uh, 17 to my Corona, but only a seven to Zadar. Okay. Uh, so 17 plus two, 19. Does 19 hit my Corona? Yes. Uh, they're going to club you. They are club kids. Uh, that says Murder Hello Inc. And that means six. Six hit points of damage. My Corona, you're up. They clock you in the head. One. Oh, no. Odd, you hit yourself. Even you hit Zadar. 20. You hit Zadar. How much damage do you do? And then oh, you Lord. Stunned by the attack, she misses her mark and hits Zadar. Uh, two. Two total? Mm -hmm. uh, one hit point of damage, Zadar, as her weapon cascades off your head, and that puts us back to the top of the order. Okay. And that's Zadar, right? Yep. Okay. All right. Uh, I pulled Naked Lady, and she was envenomed. From last time. Nice. So. Okay. Uh, let's see. 20, not natural. Easily hits. 
Okay. So. I assume they'll get a save. Uh, yes. They'll they'll have to. I'm not sure how it does with poison. Uh, 18 plus zero, so 18. I would imagine it'll probably do half damage at best. Right, right. Okay, that's a good <laughs> roll for damage. Uh, the blade itself is just going to do 1d4 plus 3. Uh, let's see. So a uh, total of 4 points for the blade damage. Now, right. the, this is the, the pisser is the poison damage. So uh, let's see. It's uh, 2d10. Um, so uh, a total of five. So I guess he takes five damage on top of that. Uh, no, he'll t he saved for half. So round down. So he takes two. Two. Okay. Yep. So okay. And your offhand. Or uh, your offhand. Uh, no, my offhand. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and attack with that. Uh, that's a miss. Okay, they're pissed. Uh, this time a six for my Corona, but an 18 for Zadar, yes. but let's see on even. He's going to light you up with some sacred flame. Oh, crap. Uh, so a blue light shoots out of his fingertips and hits you for seven hit points. Wow. Okay. My Corona, you're up. Maybe hit the bad guy this time. 16. Easily hits him. Uh, I'm going to... Oh, go ahead. Uh, how many hit points did he hit, hit me for? Seven. Uh, seven? Okay. Not looking good. Okay, I'm going to use my Warhammer. <clears throat> and... Uh, one, two, two, bludgeoning. Oh. Uh, nine. Nicely done. Top of the order. Zadar. Okay. Gonna rapier the guy that I've been attacking? Yep. Okay. Uh, let me check something on the, on the poison. Uh, I just wanted to know, uh, the poison lasts for a minute, so I guess he has to make a saving throw each time, I guess? Uh, 16? 16 beats it, yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, rapier attack. Uh, 18. Easily. Okay. <laughs> Seven, four, 11 points of damage. He's down. Okay. Uh, my Corona, you've got the only one standing. Uh, that's a four, so they're going to miss. You're up. Uh... Eight. This is top of the order, Zadar. Okay. Uh, let's see. All right, rapier in hand. I'm going to rapier attack. Uh, 18. Yep. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, that's uh, 10 points of damage from the rapier. I'm going to offhand attack with the dagger. Yep. Uh, let's see. Uh, do you add, add an attack modifier on an offhand attack? Not unless you're proficient. Hey, it's a dagger, so I'm proficient. So I'll give you, I'll give you the add. Okay. All right. So uh, 15. Okay. Okay. And let's see. That is, uh, it's not the Envenom dagger. So uh, four points of additional damage. Fuck this. I surrender. Um, I kind of hold them at bay. I say, um, well, hang on. Uh, my Corona's up. Oh, okay. Fifteen. Hit dead. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I was going to war hammers in space. Now, is uh, the other one dead? Yeah, they're both dead. I, uh, let's search them. Do they have yeah, any like, potions or anything like that on them? Uh, both of your D12. Okay. Uh, 11. 
10. Uh, each one of you finds two gold pieces and like a tea bag of foul smelling herbs. Foul smelling herbs. I will take medicine checks from those. Yeah, I was about to say. <laughs> okay. 17. Uh, yeah, Zadar is just a six. Uh, my Corona, you have heard rumors of something called the Tea Bag of Life. Uh, if you, if this is what that is, you can put it in water or any other fluid, excluding urine, uh, to create a somewhat tart but useful healing potion. Okay, that works. Do you want to tell Zadar that, or just? Say no, just kind of no. This is nothing. Uh, here, I'll take yours. No, I'll, I'll tell him. Okay. Uh, uh, table talk. Uh, did we get healing potions before before this? No, but if we didn't use them last time, we still have them, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Did you uh, get them last time? Yeah. Yeah, I got one. So okay. I think we each got one, didn't we, Carrie? I don't remember. I think we each got I've one. I think you gave then. us one. Okay. So. I'll give you a healing potion. Okay. Uh, what is this, the standard? D8 uh, plus two, no ones. Okay. Okay. Uh, nine. I, I drink it down for, for nine points sure. of healing. Okay. There you go. Uh, other than that, these guys have uh, holy symbols and their robes. Uh, my Corona, your uh, your victim's robe is covered in his brain. Zadar, yours it has several holes in it. Uh, yeah, we're not going to be able to use town these. on him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, the robes aren't going to work for us. Uh, boy, I tell you, the, uh, these churches in these towns are pretty damn rough. <laughs> so, obviously, the first group is lying. Yeah. We don't know exactly what's up with this other group, and we don't know how truthful emo mustache people are. Yeah, I don't think they're going to be very, so... very forthcoming. Eho de ombre. <laughs> yeah. Jesus. Emo mustache. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, do, do we just want to play well with ends against the middle? Do we, I mean, what do we want to do? Uh, you know, it's just like, uh, at this point, uh, it's just like, you know, we're not getting anywhere on the information train about no. this. I'm, I mean, but at least we got a line on, 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 what is it? Emo del Ombre? Emo mustache, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, you could try to, like, shift into a really handsome male and see if the guy inside likes you, and maybe that would work. I don't know. Oh, man. It's just, it just, just keeps getting better. You know, like, they got, they got religious symbols on them, you said? Like right, medallions? Mm-hmm. Are, are they medallions? Mm-hmm. Okay. Made out of wood. Okay. Well... Uh, twigs, twigs lashed together. Well, that's interesting. Real high end. Yeah, yeah. there are no uh, sons. Okay. So maybe uh, we have two opposing uh, religions. Yeah, yeah. It seems like we do. Uh, okay, I tell you what. I'll take you up on your advice. I'm going to shift into a really good-looking uh, human. We're talking of the Antonio Banderas character uh, caliber. We do like Antonio Banderas almost as much as we like turtles. <laughs> as much as you like what? Turtles. Turtles? turtles? That, that's a Tosh.0 point oh joke. Oh, I, you see, I Shout have out never, Daniel Tosh. I've never watched Daniel Tosh. So. It's stupid, but it's funny. Okay. He likes turtles. <laughs> so you go back in to see. Uh, yeah, and I make sure I I tuck in one of the 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 medallions yeah just for information just to produce it if you know right. if the guy is interested my corona are you gonna go in yeah i'll go in okay are uh, you gonna hang back with zadar or go up with zadar uh i'm gonna go is tiffany still there oh no she's gone she's oh. gone by now <laughs> i'll go sit at a table close by okay, okay. zadar uh you approach stoolie mm-hmm 
Yeah. yeah it's just. Um. Yeah, Ooh, so, no nuts. Yeah, no nuts. Obviously. Yeah, it's just Can like. Can I help you? Hmm. Uh, was wondering if you could tell me a little bit about this. I reached in and said a I shitty took holy it. symbol. Yeah, I took it from these two yahoos in the in the oh, alley. You took it, you thief, Salvatore. You're a thief. I need to call the guards. You gonna thief me? No. Oh, is that what this is? Okay. No, I, no. I go over. You again? <laughs> what, is this your friend? Is this your pimp? What the fuck, man? No, I was the pimp to the that six that was in here earlier. <laughs> I'm just like, no, no. What do you guys want? Look, we just Jeez. want some information, okay? Yeah. Okay. What do you want? Uh, well, what's the I mean, deal I'm with... trying to do business here. What's the deal with this group? I don't know. The triangle group. Okay. The cultists. Okay. I don't know. And I think they're the red herring cultists, would be my guess. Red herring cultists? Yeah. Okay. Is he there with, word for that? with a big group of people? No, he's watching the table. Okay. It's just like, well, uh, just, to, just to be straight up and honest and for the... Oh, that would be refreshing. Yeah, yeah, it Can would I be refreshing. stab him? <laughs> no. No, I like hold her hand. I was just like, <sighs> no, don't stab him. It's just like no, we'd like an audience with uh, with mm, Ebo mustache guy, Mister Del Ombre, if you will. Yeah, I got time. You have You're... time. Yeah, I got time. Is that is that who you are? No, I'm not Emo the mustache guy. <laughs> <laughs> I am Stooley the Weasel. Well, we don't All want right. to talk to you. We want to talk to your boss. Well, it's going to cost you. Okay, how much? 30. Man, that's an awful lot. 30 what? Silver. Oh, all right. Yeah, I produced 30 silver. I said, does it, will this get us in? Sure, yeah. What's okay. problem? Okay. When I do this... We've got some information for him if he's interested. Sure. Okay. Uh, so he takes you. Let's do the share. Uh, let's see here. Stooley is going to lead you down here past the temple, and there's graffiti right here mm -hmm. uh, that says they are lying to you. <laughs> okay. He takes you into the farmland. Very scenic route. Uh, both of you give me D20 rolls. Okay. Dear God, he's going to dump us and kill us. <laughs> actually, uh, actually, I don't oh, think shit. so. Uh, natural 20. Six. Uh, you step in a microwave, you step in a puddle of uh, cow urine. <laughs> uh, you go through the gate out into the large open fields, up the trail, and here in the public park, surrounded by olive trees, is a man just waiting there. He okay. probably hates all that he wife. And Stooley goes. Did he call with a cell phone? How did he know to be there? Uh, you also notice right here, uh, there are additional men sleeping. Oh, great. Uh, okay. It, it, you can assume that it is the Seguidora. Yeah. Posse. It's Posse. Okay. Uh, man looks at you and he goes, can I help you? Uh, yes. Are you Mr. Del Ambre? I am Mustachio. <laughs> uh, sir, um, we, uh, there's been a bounty put on your head by those fuckers at the church that you say that are lying. Uh, we're new in town, and they tried to try to hire us to find you, but I, I'm believing that nothing that they say is true. I would agree with you. So, I and, think that they are liars and false lovers of religion. Hmm. 
Uh, I mean, from what I understand, we talked to one of the vagrant kids around here, and they said that they've been stealing All from children the... are God's children. Yeah, uh, I, I, I would tend to agree. You know that that's why we weren't mean to her at all. We even got her out of trouble. Hmm. Gonna lie to Eho. Okay. No, we got her out of trouble. Nice to her. We got her into trouble, but then we got her out of it. <laughs> that twenty on insight for him. Okay. 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 Uh, that doesn't. Which is up and plucks an olive. Okay. <laughs> and it's just like. We've been hired by them, but I, I can say they are not trustworthy at all. And um, there's nothing for us to there's nothing for us to recoup from this. And um, you know, uh, we came here seeking your audience. We've discovered that there's two factions here, two churches. Are they both in control of the town? I believe the magistrate is in charge of the town. Okay. As for religions, there are at least three major religions in this town. Yeah. Are they all equally as corrupt? I will not say. Oh. Okay. Can I stab this guy? Mustachio? I'm sure you can stab <laughs> Yeah, with, that, with all the Segundo or whatever <laughs> around there? Uh no, I, I stay here. I make hand. a frustrated humrumping noise. Harump, harump, harump. Uh, uh, per perception, both of you. Okay. All right. Uh, and not perceptive. So perception for for Zadar is about an eight. Fourteen. Uh, Zadar, you're focused in on Eho. Uh, my Corona, you notice that uh, Stooley the Weasel is gone and the Seguidora are soundly sleeping. Oh, okay. It seems as though you would have a dilemma on your hands. I would assume that there was a, you said, bounty on my head? Yes. Yeah, but I'm not interested in taking it at this point. It's just like, you know, I mean, I've been through enough <laughs> here. At this point, I would just like to screw over the sons of whatever. Fair enough. Yeah. yeah. It seems like the mon money lenders are in on it, too. They're accusing you of robbing them. I do not rob people. That is not my job. I know. Like I said, these are all accusations. So, so yeah. they said that you stole two thousand gold from them. Search me. I don't have two thousand gold, and you can tell from his apparel, eh, this guy don't have two thousand gold. Yeah, he's dressed in a ratty robe and sandals. Oh, for the love of God! Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. <clears throat> Roll initiative. Oh, Lord. Okay. 22. Okay. Uh, Zadar got... Uh, I hate rolling first on initiative 16. <laughs> oh, you aren't first. Uh, okay. <clears throat> my Corona behind you, you hear, there he is, arrest him. Oh shit, we were being tailed. As you turn around, there's one of these guys and four guards. Then they march up with their spears and demand Eho surrender immediately. Um, hmm. Um. So my Corona, you're up first. Note that this guy is not somebody that you know. So you can surmise that the likelihood of a payday is slipping away quickly. I use my Warhammer on him. On the guards? Yeah, whoever. Whoever's closest. Two guards on you, two guards on Zidar. Okay. 
It's Fright Night! Fright Night! Okay. Uh, go ahead and attack, my Corona. Uh, 12. Uh, 12 is exactly what you need. Okay, let's see. Four. Okay. Is it R? Okay. Um, I rolled an eight. You rolled an eight? Yeah. Okay. Start at the bottom again. Okay. Okay, with rapier, uh, 18. Hit. 12 okay. is all you need. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, uh, five damage with the rapier. Gonna use the naked lady dagger in my offhand. Mm -hmm. Uh, that misses. I rolled a one. Okay. Uh, they will attack you. Because it's on. Ding, ding, go. My Corona. Uh, 12 and a 10 does a 14 get you? Nope. Zanar. Uh, cunning action. <laughs> if I can take it now. 16. Sure, you can take it. Okay. Uh, gonna, gonna try to disengage real quick. Just to put some distance between us, I guess. Uh, five feet. Five feet's not gonna do it. I don't. Does a sixteen even hit you? Uh yeah, yeah, it does. You know what? D twelve against me. If you beat me, uh, you manage to step back. Uh, nine. Six. So you manage to step back, and I miss. Uh, top okay. of the order, my Corona. Twenty-two. It's again. Are you going after the wounded one or the other one? I'll go after the wounded one. Okay. Mm -hmm. Shit. Ooh. Get him, Corona. Eight. Fair enough. Zadar. Okay. Uh, Rapier. Uh, sorry. Ugh. Uh, uh, does a uh, 16 hit? Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, six points of damage with the rapier. Same one or the mm -hmm. other? Yeah, same one. Gotcha. Okay. And uh, with the offhand, 14? Yes. Okay. Uh, let's see. It's envenomed. Oh, uh, let's see. 17 plus 1, 18. Eight, he'll resist the poison. Uh, uh, with the offhand, it's only going to be four points of damage. Fair enough. Their turn on uh, my Corona. Uh, 16 and a 20, so 18 and yep. 22. Okay. Uh, they are going to do a shift. Damage. Or not. Uh, five hit points of damage. Zadar. Uh, two and a six. Double misses. Top of the order, my Corona. Uh, both of you perception check first. Uh, Perceptione. Uh, 17. 18. You both notice that this guy is taking off, presumably going for reinforcements. Okay, my Corona, you're up. Your scores were also high enough that the Seguidera are waking up. 19. Hits easily. So can I go after the guy that's running? Uh, no, he'll be out of range and that's not a missile weapon. Okay. Um, can I go after my unwounded one? Sure, now you still have the wounded one. Okay, I'll go after the wounded one. Okay, yeah, you haven't killed anybody yet. Ooh. Uh, 10. 
Uh, you killed somebody now. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> uh, uh, Zidar, you're up. Oh, okay. Uh, I was waiting for the go. It's just like, uh, okay. Uh, rapier attack, 16. Yep. Okay. Uh, uh, for the rapier, it is... Um, uh, same guy or different guy? Same guy. Five okay. points of damage. Gonna okay. attack with the envenomed offhand. Yep. Uh, 19. Yeah. Hits. Okay. Only had one hit point left. So you uh, each have one on you. Green is my corona. Orange is an off. Uh, 18 and an 8. Zadar, uh, dirty 20. Okay. Uh, that That's what you rolled was a dirty 20? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, that definitely hits. Uh, six hit points of damage on you. Yikes. Okay. As he opens up a nice head wound on you. Um, top of the order, my corona. 20. Nat 20 or just 20? Just 20. Got it. Six. Nicely done. Zadora? Or Zadar? Zadora. <laughs> Pia Zadora. <That's> right. <laughs> wow, now you're dating yourself. Wow, yeah, that's no. <laughs> At least oh this group knows who that is. Uh, 19. Hit. Okay. All right, finally. Okay, with the rapier, uh, uh, 11 points of damage. Going to roll for the arf hand. Uh, let's see. Offhand, uh, 17 to hit. Mm -hmm. Okay, and uh, see, for the weapon damage, uh, five points for the weapon damage, and for the venom. Uh, At 20. Oh, you resisted. <laughs> yeah, your poison blows. Uh, their turn. Uh, 16 plus 2 and a 3. Uh, my Corona, does an 18 get you? Uh, yes. Uh, take 400 points more of damage, and you are up. The good news is the trip to this hill uh, took a while, so this guy is going to be a while. You also notice, both of you, that the Seguidera have surrounded uh, Mustachio. 17. Hit. Three. Not good enough. Zidar. Uh, uh, with the rapier, uh, it is uh, 18. Hit. To hit. Okay. Uh, eight points uh, damage with the rapier, uh, the envenomed offhand. Uh, that is uh, 17 to hit. He's dead. Okay. All right. Uh, the only one left is on my Corona. Uh, eight plus two is 10. That's not going to hit. My Corona, you're up. Eight. Not good enough. Zadar. Okay. Uh, 17. Hit. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> uh, let's see. Uh, six points of damage with the rapier. Fair enough. And with the dagger, natural 20. Easily. Okay. Uh, let's see. Two on the poison. Okay, so. Uh, <laughs> uh, so, 11 points of damage? Down he goes. Okay. Behind you, you hear stop. Stop, my friends. Stop. Okay. You turn around. The Seguidera have got. Uh, uh, Hector, Macho, Camacho, Iho, uh, <laughs> surrounded, and he breaks apart out of them. Mm. 
Why are you doing this? They were going to attack. I think they were going to arrest me. Yeah. Yeah, it's just... Um, I don't think there was any need for bloodshed. You are an innocent bystander. Why should you be arrested? Persuade me. Eighteen. Uh, Eighteen is enough to persuade the Segwadera to also chime in and tell Eho that he needs to leave. Uh, Zadar, D12 against me. Okay. Two. Uh, nine. Eho stops and says, fine, I will go with you. But first, and he lays hands on my Corona's first victim. Light extends from it. The wounds heal, the man blinks his eyes, and crawls up to his knees and says, thank you, Evo. And he says, you're welcome, Lazarus. <laughs> the Seguidera then escort Eho, which means uh, son of Ombre, man away from the hill with the olive grove grove on it happy easter everybody happy easter we were playing good friday <laughs> <laughs> now did either one of you catch that any of the references first no not until the very end because not until yeah. the olive yeah because, you know, i'm a heathen a heathen oh sorry. man but yes, I, I came up with that idea and I thought, fuck it. So, yes. Yeah. Iho uh, da Ombre is the son of man. Oh. Uh, and man. you have successfully avoided him having to go in front of Capus, a uh, conscious pilot. Yes. So, uh, had you taken him over, uh, he, if you would have arrested him, you would have gone peacefully. Uh -huh. uh, and the magistrate would have been. Yeah, but they would have they would arrested us, and, and we'd be the two on the sides. sides. No, nope, you you would have been paid. You uh, would have been paid. Now, did you catch the, the thirty uh, silver? The thirty silver yes. for Stuart yes. the Weasel. So. Yes. Okay, a little bit campy, but no, know. no, it all makes sense now. It's just like thirty pieces of silver. He yeah, went because and it's got the legendary beginnings. Yeah. It's not, it's not about you, as Dr. Yeah, Phil would right. say. It was about the start of the religion. Because there's three major religions in, in town. town. Yeah. And the City of the Rock. That, yes. That represents Somalia. So. Yes. Uh, see, everybody, everybody but Indians. I did, I'm sorry. I didn't get any Hindus in there. Um, uh, but uh, no, it was, it was fun. I mean, um, I mean, encounters like this i mean in an urban environment i mean where it's you know i mean it could go either way anyway so i mean you and, know. and to be fair carrie did not know what the uh what the storyline was i did not i had no clue he okay wouldn't, he wouldn't I, tell I, me I, I kept i kept it secret I kept it, it, it wasn't until we were taken out of the city where things actually started to click but by at that point it was just like we are not going to get anywhere so <laughs> I, I was really kind of hoping ashley would play to see how long it would take her oh she my god she really botched uh the she would have taken the 30 pieces of silver and oh, go yeah. get them <laughs> yeah, she would have presented the head so oh, yeah. Uh, but yeah so let's go with uh we're, we're done a little bit early which is rare uh yeah. but uh you didn't turn over the savior of mankind so i couldn't fucked I up the religion entirely yeah. and I, now he'll probably die on a bus accident or something oh no jesus taxied his way for your sins uh, uh so go ahead david final thoughts what do you think uh final thoughts i thought it was fun i mean i, I like little urban adventures like this i mean being a level two i mean uh, yeah i mean it's it's fine i mean i got to use something that i couldn't use before i got to use a cunning action so <laughs> now how uh how many hit points were you left with eight okay 
Uh, yeah. Carrie, how many hit points did you have left? I think I had 11. Okay, so there there was definitely the consideration of... But I had the tea bag of saving. That's, that's... <laughs> yeah, and I had already popped my potion, so... So, Carrie, what did you think since you did not know what the storyline was? It was good. It was cute. I, it was at the end when I figured it out. I was like, "Oh, really?" Uh, I kept trying to watch all your faces to see. Yeah, if I was just like, "There's going to be a light on there." I have. Right. But again, since I am, uh, yeah, you're ca- you're Catholic. Oh yeah, you're one of these right there. Duh. Uh, I have. Yeah. So it took a little longer for me. Uh uh-uh. uh yeah, well, we're 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 followers of Eho, so. <laughs> well, well, with uh, with Holy Week being on here, I I staunchly considered the twelve stages of the cross to see if you would actually save Jesus or if one of you would help. Wow, him that would have been long. That would have yeah. been. Long. And I never would have gotten that. Wow. So. Uh, yeah. Well, you know, a guy dragging like across the cartoons that they have at the Catholic Church that I asked you about. <laughs> <laughs> The cartoons. I'm married to a heathen. It's the twelve it. stations. I'm like, what is this? Oh my god! Episode one. Or the barbed yeah, wire. episode one, episode yeah. two. Yeah, it's just like uh, you clearly say episode so many... four, five, and six were way better than the other uh, other. Eight. Right. You say so many owl fathers here. So many. <laughs> it's hard explaining that. <laughs> but uh, I, I'm glad you guys had a good time, uh, David. Mm-hmm pointed out urban adventures are kind of fun because yeah you know, or anything can happen yeah uh, i like the fact that you guys held on to tiffany uh i, yeah. I was gonna give her the name magdalene but i knew that one. oh yeah, i to give it away early so yeah. I went to tiffany. Yeah. uh because I, the book of tiffany is really one of the better books in the bible if you haven't read it i, I suggest i've heard that bible yeah there. uh but yeah i i you know it was campy, it was corny, but uh, yeah, you know, sometimes with D&D, you, you just have to... I mean, at, at first I had no idea where this was going to go. I was at just first like... I was afraid. <laughs> I was <laughs> uh, but no, I'm oh, glad man. you guys enjoyed it. So, uh, folks at home, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, sorry we didn't run the full two hours, but sometimes that happens. Kyle. When, when you're a good DM, Kyle, you yeah. know, that's what happens. <laughs> To <laughs> cut it, uh, but uh, follow us on Twitch. Follow us on Twitter. Take a look at our YouTube archive. If you want to buy cool stuff, it's down there. If you want to chat with us on the Discord channel, it's down there. Uh, tomorrow night we have the campaign game. Uh, we'll see how they do at Battle Keep. The last time they were there, it was filled with a bunch of face fighters. Maybe they die. Maybe they die. I don't know. Die. <laughs> uh, on Sunday, Carol's taking the big chair. And uh, she's running four people uh, in a prisoner swap scenario, third level. So we'll see how that turns out. Don't forget, if you want a bingo card for tomorrow night's game, let us know. We will get you that. Uh, I think we still have the magnetic dice that nobody has yet to win. Uh, So I'll throw it out there now. Doge. Uh, But uh, for all of us, uh, however you spend this holiday, we hope you enjoy it. We're sorry that you're all still secluded and isolated. It will get better, people. Remember to wash your hands. Uh, yes. David and I will wave and wash our hands uh, while our favorite producer goes ahead and kills us off. So, bye, everybody. Bye, 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 bye. bye.